The factory, which opened its doors in 2002, was involved in cutting and polishing marble and granite and produced hulls, tops and slabs. It, however, faced liquidation from creditors in 2012 as it was unable to carry out full production operations due to limited financial resources and machinery. Schledwein said it is against this background that he undertook a trip to the factory to get the modalities in place for the Finnish investors to get into negotiations with creditors and shareholders in order to revive the factory's operations. He said Namibia's dimension stones are of good quality and are in abundance and can create a huge demand, especially among international markets. Therefore, it was important, he said, to get the investors to add value to the stones and get business going. Aware, of course, that this factory is um, encumbered and de facto insolvent, our state-owned financial institutions were the main creditors, it's the Mineral Fund and the Development Bank. If the Finnish are to invest in the factory, all manufacturing, packaging and distribution of products from the factory would be done locally. This, he said, would not only create much needed employment, but also contribute to economic growth. The Namibia Stone Processing is currently owned by a Namibian and Angolan partners.